Hey guys, I just wanted to make this little video, little project I've been screwing around with today. Uh, I got a couple thermoelectric coolers, but I'm using them for generators, thermoelectric generators. Let's see, got a pot of ice here. The two thermoelectric coolers are underneath of it. On the wood stove here. You see the two of them here. Not very big. You can see the voltage is 1.6 and dropping. Now I'm going to throw a couple pieces of ice on here. I'm just going to rub a piece of ice on each one. Watch the uh, voltage. That's just a piece of ice I'm rubbing on each one of them. You can see once we hit 4 volts, these lights came on. These lights are actually hooked to these little thermoelectric coolers. I'll take the ice off, lights go out, cool them back down. The voltage is about three. And I'm just going to set the pot right on top of the coolers. You can see we got 4.2 volts, and these lights are on. They only stay on for a few seconds. Once everything neutrals back out, like I said, these lights just plug into this little cord here. Go right up. To these two thermoelectric coolers are in series so the negative from one goes to the positive of the other you can see the lights are still on here we got 3.9 volts there's my meter three point eight you see the lights are out now they're on a little bit. I'm just going to turn the pot a little. See if it makes a difference. I got to come up with a better means of cooling the cold side. So they do work for generators. I had one earlier that I hooked up to 12 volts. And uh, one side gets real hot and the other side cools down pretty quick. Actually f froze my finger to it messing around. So you can see there's the modules. There's your volts. The pan off. The lights are out. I'm just going to take some ice. Rub it on these. your voltage will start to climb pretty good. And the lights are coming on now. Let's see how high we can get it up with rubbing the ice on it. It's hard to rub them both at the same time. Pan back on them. See starts climbing right up. Like I said, if I could find a better means of cooling these, maybe with some cold liquid or something. It's basically just a little project to mess around with today. Our voltage is at 3.83. Alrighty guys, thanks for watching.